Now, in this video, I'd like to talk a bit about what exactly you're going to be expecting from uh, the course that I have here on my channel regarding HTML and CSS. Now, as time goes, quality gets updated from, from time to time because you move, you go to a new location, you get better equipment. So as time goes inside this course here as well, you're going to experience a slightly different quality change inside some of the lessons. Now, I will point out one thing that's really important to point out about my specific course here, which is that whenever something gets updated in real life, meaning that there's something new added to HTML or CSS, I always update my lessons and include new lessons into the course in order to keep you guys updated when it comes to creating HTML and CSS. So what I'm basically trying to say here is that the first lessons in this course here are not going to be as high quality visually as the later episodes in this course, but they're still relevant to what you're going to learn. So don't get fooled by the quality of some of the older lessons that are in this course here. Now, just to talk about who I am as the teacher here in the channel, my name is Daniel Nilsson. I live in Denmark and doing YouTube here is something that I recently jumped into full time, at least as I'm uploading this video. Now, educationally wise, I have a bachelor in web development and multimedia design, which is also why I love to teach these specific subjects on this channel here. My original plan was actually to become a university teacher, but then YouTube sort of happened. And now I'm here teaching you guys with something I think is better when it comes to reaching out to more people. So I hope to be able to share my knowledge with as many people as possible around the world. Now, I should also mention that inside most of my lessons inside this channel here, including this course, you're going to be finding all the lesson files in the description of the video where you can download them on my Patreon. So if you want to support me on Patreon, then you'll have access to all the lessons files. And these lesson files are available in case you need any sort of extra help when it comes to these lessons inside HTML and CSS. So having said all this, I hope that you will enjoy my lessons and I hope to see you in the next episode.